evening, and welcome to my coffee quarantine nook. No. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna tuck this in. I don't. I feel exposed and unsafe. Today, we're gonna be answering the question: Is it still coffee if you make it without a coffee maker inside a coronavirus quarantine, using only things that you would find in your coronavirus quarantine? Because you went out and you bought all the toilet paper and you bought all the respirators, didn't you? You did, didn't you? This is all I've got, and once this is done. I'm wiping with bread. None of that ancient grain stuff. That's like one ply sandpaper. It's getting real, real warm in this quarantine, but we gotta stay safe. So today, I'm gonna try and make coffee using an entire roll of two ply toilet paper. Seems like a good use. You know how rare this is gonna be in like three days? We used to, we used to wipe with this. Now you're wiping with bread, aren't you? Do this like a stylish, uh, you know how they wear like their like rich white people in the summer. They're like, ah, oh, I brought a sweater, but I had never intended on wearing it on my body. They just wear it like a sweater belt. Hi, my name's Chad. This is just 18 feet of coffee filter, so my plan here is to just TP this cup of coffee. Because if you listen closely, listen, and you hear that? That's the rainforest crying. Remember that commercial for toilet paper like a long time ago with the bear? And uh, like you see the bear wipe its, wipe its bare ass with toilet paper. That was a little much, wasn't it? Ugh. All right, I've located the coffee cup. It's in there somewhere. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna put the coffee, hopefully, sort of over top right there. I'm really hoping that underneath this is gonna be a fantastic cup of coffee in about three minutes. And if you wanna get coffee sort of something like this, you can go check out my website, darkroastcult.com. And if you're Canadian, we got darkroastcult.ca too. Soon, you'll be able to buy coffee that looks a little something like this. If you want to order stickers that I've been making, you can check those out on my website, shrugsquat.com. And one more for good luck. There we go. I actually don't trust water coming directly out of the tap, so I'd like to filter it a little bit with this. Just put that right on top. I really hope there's a mug underneath this. Oh boy. Oh, we've got some trouble. Oh, it's like a volcano. Don't, no, no. There we go. Keep the beans and Oh, oh it's, it's coming out this side now. Do we have any more toilet paper? Do we have any to... Ah! That water's hot. Don't touch it. Oh, God, why did I do that again? Oh, man, this is, this is not great. I don't know how full this coffee cup is underneath. This looks natural. We'll put this right in the garbage and neighbors won't ask any questions. All right, and so, um... We have a delicious cup of coffee here. I cannot wait to drink what trickled through. <laughs> okay, let's try a little more, because I do like my coffee to be there uh, and exist. Oh, this is this looks like the wrong kind of hot brown bean water, if you know what I mean. I think probably the problem was I had the mask over top, and that was filtering out everything, even the water. I think it filtered out all the viruses. Yeah. It's not go It's not going through at all. Because <laughs> it's Costco brand. Oh, I'm getting grinds in there. I gotta drink that still. I want. I want to get my. I want to harvest the coffee out of here. Can I do that? You're doing a great job. I'm just palming this hot ball of bean water. Ah! I'm trying to milk the coffee out of it if I could. Yeah, I know it's not great. Hold on, oh, wait, wait, wait. This, might, this might be alright. This is worse. This is worse. Ah. Oh. It's real easy to burn yourself these days. Seems like everything is just hot and ready to hurt you. Come on. 
right, that's probably enough for a sample, huh? This is really gross. <laughs> Let's try and make it a little better. I don't think there's enough cream in the universe to make this better. <laughs> I can pretend I don't see the grinds floating in it. It might be all right. I guess it's one thing left to do is to run our taste test here. Tastes like a stranger's toilet paper cough. Oh, there's like toilet paper still on the cup. Oh, that's, that was just a big sip of <coughs> coffee grounds too. No, that tastes terrible. Uh, taste, <laughs> with one being the lowest one, for sure. Um, that tastes <laughs> terrible. As for prep, again, one. That was a lot of work. Just for one terrible sip of terrible coffee. Oh, cleanup's gonna be a bit. I guess we just put this all in a big bag, right? That, call it a call it a ten. Ten being the best. Uh, well, let's, let's go with seven because this table might have some water damage to it. Um, other than that, not a bad experience. Didn't have to leave the house, and uh, I don't feel like I'm dying. <laughs> Maybe use a regular coffee maker on this one. This wasn't worth it. You check out my website. I will soon be selling my own brand of coffee. Uh, the stickers are for sale, uh, free shipping worldwide. And um, please don't use toilet paper to make coffee. It's, it's not good. If you have any suggestions for something I should try and make coffee with, leave it in a comment below wherever you're watching this video. Don't forget to check out the links in the description. I got a new Instagram account and all that. Um, 